Hi guys, Jake from Offroad TV. Um, today we've got guys here with us from West Coast Recovery Specialists. Um, we're running through their rig and talking about their business, but while we are here, apparently there is a really interesting run from here from Lancelin up to the wedge. So we were thinking, if you guys have a bit of time today, are you up for it? Yep. Yeah, absolutely. Let's go yeah. down some fuel and have some fun. All right. Have you guys done it before? Yeah, yeah. we've done it a fair bit. Yeah. I was actually up here a week ago, so... Let's go uh, yeah. test out the patrol, hey? Let's give it a try. See how many times we get stuck. <laughs> You're with the right people if you do. <laughs> yeah, we know a guy. Make sure you guys don't get stuck because I'm not digging this out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. All right, let's, let's get into it. it. So if you guys are familiar, Lentilin to Wedge is about 20 kilometers or so beach run. It really depends on the time of the day. If there is a low tide, it's fairly easy run. But if there is high tide or, or higher tide, it can get quite challenging because the sand is quite soft towards the top of the beach. So as you can tell, this is quite a low tide. So the run was fairly easy. We decided to stop and have a bit of fun. So after that we just kept driving, we passed the wedge um, and we ended up in the dunes that are just north of Wedge uh, and we decided to have a bit of fun there. What do you got to say off-road TV? This is life. <laughs> Everyone, get whatever hobbies you have and get out, explore. What a Enjoy day, life. what a day. Hell yeah. And then <laughs> this happened. <laughs> So that's what in the experience circles we call being stuck. Do you, um, do you guys know a tow, tow company? Uh, well, as it turns out, we actually have one here. Really? I, I um, they've got a 20 ton winch. I might be able to pull you back. I mean, you're sort of stuck on a way down. How does that work? <laughs> Alright, so this is Darren's second try. He obviously gave it a little bit more power and he made it. There you go. And then we just couldn't stop well, having it. fun. We go. Well, I couldn't resist, so I gave it a try as well with the four tons. And yeah, that was a bit of air. Just look at this place, isn't that just incredible? I mean, this is an hour north drive from Perth and anyone can just come here over the weekend and just go have fun. I'm pretty sure I got some air. You did? <laughs> Yeah, he's getting cocky now. Yep, so at this point we thought it would be a great idea to jump a GoPro. So, let's see how that went. Oh 
fire damage? No, it's all good. So after having some fun on the dunes, we decided to just park at the beach and spend the rest of the afternoon there and, you know, just rest and enjoy the beach and the ocean. So the sun was starting getting low, so we decided to head back and we found these guys on the beach uh, completely stuck. Uh, they've been there for more than an hour already trying to get the car out uh, and so we decided to help them obviously. You guys are lucky because we've got that with us. That is an 8 ton Unimog. Are you stuck? Just pretending, okay. Ah, uh, you might need to pull this guy out first. You might need to pull this guy out first. <laughs> oh, you gotta use one of those? No shit. Now's the time to learn. Yeah, fuck Who's learning? Let's go, last one. Look, listen, listen. Oh man, so you've got basically screw it on like you would anything else. That there, you push it in. Yeah. You unscrew, so it's actually unscrewing the valve inside. Unscrew it. Right. There's your gauge. So basically, man, these are really quick, especially on little tyres. Slide that back. Here you sort of want to be, in your situation, I'd just go, like you said, man, 10 pounds, fucking bang. All right, and then just reverse, dude, and push that in. Yep. Screw it up until it goes tight. Don't crank them, otherwise you never get it out. And then just unwind that. Right. Who wants to finish? You, 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 it's your car, you have to learn. Go on. Just bow at this time, you want to go, unscrew. This gentleman's obviously very new to full driving, so just run him down a few things like situations like this, what to do. We'll pass him by, he didn't call us, there's no charge, so you know, there's no better time to learn than the time you really need to learn. So from he obviously knows the, the bad part of uh, getting stuck, so the main thing from here is knowing how to get out, which but he could get out if he dug for probably another 30 minutes. What's the point? We're here, we'll just make sure his tyre pressures are right, we'll run him through that and then um, we'll pull him out of the hole he's in and then from there he should be fine. So you pull him backwards? Yeah, we'll pull him backwards so he can get a bit of run up through the hole.
I think your ride is ready to go. Easy. Right, thank you. Cheers. Guys, nice, nice meeting you. Yeah, nice meeting you too. Nice thank you too, bud. That's you learned something new. We all learned the same exact yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. Alright, enjoy guys. See ya.